<laughs> that's it, catch that. And those are the tri those are tricks. <laughs> you know, I just love that's that. my baseball caps as well. It's your cap, is it? Yeah. yeah. Um, you're going with Jacquetta's personality and, and how she was feeling that day and that the fantastic embroidery. That was from the, Vis the collection shown in Versailles, inspired by Persian miniatures. That's the way we showed it on the runway. Right. This is how it's been um, reinterpreted for someone like Jacquetta to wear today. Um, yeah, initially that was Persian miniatures. And that was a good one. That's absolute delicacy, doesn't it? Very fine beans. That must be an enormous fine Yeah, that was that was an amazing one when you showed that one. Um, beautiful. Beautiful. Because you know like when you've cut those pieces as well, what I forgot to say earlier. And those pan shapes have been thread marked and it's all on the bias, so it kind of moves everywhere the fabric. It's you know, just moving constantly. That then has to be reattached onto a frame before a beader can even start to be. The grain has to be meticulously reproduced again on this frame so that the beads, so when, you know, when the whole thing comes off, it's ease and, and, and moves. It's not like it moves the way it has to. Yeah. yeah. <coughs> so I think it, it's, it's almost, not, not mathematical, it's almost scientific in, yeah, in, in, in a way. There's a lot of you're relying on science thinking behind it to make of, it of, of the ateliers, it's absolutely, yes. absolutely, yes. No. and you know shapes. Well, people don't normally realise because you can create a shape, I and mean, we can, we can, we can, uh, you know, bang together a shape like that. But when you see the auteur ateliers do it, and it moves like a cloud, and it's so light, but the volume is exactly what you want. Um, you know. But then I can knock it up and get an effect, but you couldn't just glide down around it. They know how to. They know how to do it. Where to put the, the tool underneath the skirt to create that volume? And what's the fabric? How the crimps laid on to make that skirt flare? Right? I mean, it is technique. It's amazing.